The United Nations Security Council has overruled objections from China and Russia and held a session about North Korea's human rights record. The council meeting comes days after the UN General Assembly voted in favour of referring Pyongyang to the International Criminal Court to face charges of crimes against humanity. Not content with denying freedom of expression to its own people, the North Korean regime now seems intent on suppressing the exercise of this fundamental freedom in our nation. This is absurd. Yet it is exactly the kind of behavior we have come to expect from a regime that threatened to take, quote, merciless countermeasures, end quote, against the U.S. over a Hollywood comedy and has no qualms about holding tens of thousands of people in harrowing gulags. Separately, on Monday, North Korea suffered severe internet outages, which were later partially restored. The U.S. accused Pyongyang of hacking Sony Pictures, leading to the cancellation of the release of a film which depicts the assassination of the North Korean leader.